Good evening, YouTubers. The new Time Travel Jaime 88. I'm back with another video review. And tonight, I got another VHS review I want to show you guys. It is the very funny movie of 1989. What am I talking about? I give you Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventures. Yup, totally, dude. This movie is fantastic. I love this movie. It made me laugh. I saw this movie 10 times on television. This movie is originally released in theaters on February 17th, 1989. The movie is set in San Dimas, California. In the future, the year 26 AD, that's when Rufus is taxed by the leaders about the two great ones of Bill S. Preston, Esquire, and Ted Theodore Logan by using a time machine made out shaped like a telephone booth. I had to go back in time where the dudes, Bill and Ted, flunked their history exam. As the teachers told them that if you don't fail the history, they will be end up dropping out. And that's when Ted's dad said, if you don't do it right, you'll be end up in Colonel Oates Military Academy in Alaska. And that could cost the Wild Stallions in jeopardy. So, they're trying to ask the people at Circle K until Rufus came down, come from the future and it explains about the history. So, another copy of Bill and Ted tell them to go back in time with a younger counterpart so they trust Rufus. So, the brief conversation before the travel to the year 1805, and that's when Napoleon Bonaparte. However, when they escape, soon after, Napoleon show up in the past too. When they return back home, remind him that time will continue to move forward in order to prov to m write the history for the school exam. So, Rufus Lee, Bill and Ted on our own, and while there, Ted's younger brother to watch Napoleon. However, Ted's father finds, tells Ted did he find the keys? He told, you will not leave this house until tomorrow morning. So, Bill and Ted went to the year 1879 to find Billy the Kid. Plus, Socrates, also known as Socrate from 410 BC. <laughs> there were two uh, teens who didn't, cannot pronounce it right. Plus, it also... With Simon Freud, well, Simon Freud, and Prince, well, up there in the 15th century, with Princess Joanna and Elizabeth. The teens angered the princess before they beheaded, until Billy the kid and Socrates rescued him, and then decided to make some more report including Sigmund Freud, Beethoven, Genghis Khan, John Van Art, and Abraham Lincoln. The booth is malfunctioned, so they ordered to make a crew cool repair to the time machine and end up back right where they started from at the Circle K and explain about the earlier themselves about the recent trip. When they arrive on the next day, they found Napoleon at the water park Waterloo. All of the historian figures are got in trouble and arrested. It's up to Bill and Ted to rescue him out of there and use the time machine to allow to go to the show off their presentation. Mm-hmm. So allow to send these historian figures back to their own time 
And then Rufus congratulate Bill and Ted for passing the history exam. And they brought the princesses and prearranged for marriage nothing. So they will be part of the Wild Stallions. And so they asked Rufus can join the group. And so at the end, they said they can do, they do get better. <laughs> yeah. So my thoughts on the movie Bill and Ted Excellent Adventure. This movie is very funny. And also got us into a, some kind of a ripoff from the phone booth. It's kind of a ripoff from Tardis. I wonder Gallifrey even sued Rufus for using a copycat on the Tardis. Hmm. I give this movie 10 out of 10. The movie was shot in 1987 in Phoenix, Arizona. Yup. And also, due to some... And its production was finished around 1988. Yup. The, it was originally planned to release in 1988. However, the comp the film company, Dorentis Entertainment, was bankrupt. So, Orion Pictures and Nelson Entertainment brought the rights of the movie. Yup. And after success of the film, it made a sequel, Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure, and a Saturday morning cartoon they aired on CBS and Fox from 1990 to 1992. And a short live action series on Fox. So, if you're in the 80s, make sure to pick it up. Oh, it's one more thing. I want to show you guys the cover. This is Bill and Ted. History about to be rewritten by two guys who can't spell. Here's the front. The spine of a spine, the top and the back, totally hot. I stake my life on it. Joan Van Ark T. Martley Magazine. <laughs> Ridiculous. And plus some production stills from the movie. Here's the tape, ink label. And unfortunately, there is no print date. All right. That's it for this week's uh, review. Rate, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Take care.